Then film way control, approved transit, track gate, northern corridor at the start point and report in position. Driver is now in bloodhound. Over. Bloodhound control, good morning. A temperature is plus two five and pressure nine two one millibars. Control engine confirm all is bloody good and we're just celebrating for a few minutes, over. Oh, 628. Smashed it! Smash 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 Absolutely delighted. Our first 600 mile an hour run. Personally, I'm just a tiny bit miffed. My job is to control the car as precisely as possible, so I was trying to target about 605, just to make sure we got the six number. We actually finished up with 628 miles an hour. Um, that is actually outside my control. When I lifted off the throttle, the way the jet engine winds down changes with speed, and it gave us more power for about another half second, second, and that put the extra speed on, finished up another kilometre further down the track. So that's the, uh, you know, the major learning point above 600 is the jet engine performance changes. We'll uh, put that in the plan for next year. All of that said, we came here to try and get, uh, ultimately, squeak it up to 600 miles an hour. We achieved that comfortably today. And as a real stretch target, could we reach 1,000 kilometers an hour? We are just shy of 1,011 kilometers an hour on today's run as a peak speed. That is a good result to go home with. We set out today to do 600 and we smashed it. We did 628. That's 1,010, 10, 10 kilometers an hour. And that's us done, that's mission accomplished. That's everything we set out to do in South Africa. So it's that weird moment of it's been achieved. You know, we've pushed this car exactly where we needed it to go. We've got all the data and job done. It's just phenomenal feeling. And um, I think it's also relief. We've had some low times and this is just a massive high. We've come out here to achieve what we want to achieve. We've excelled there and we're now buzzing. And this car is absolutely ready for land speed record speeds. We're all looking around now trying to work out what to do next. The reality is we've, we've achieved our goal, we've got here, you know, and you don't run in unnecessarily. Um, so we've got what we want, we're going to check the aero data off the car, and if the aero data off the car is, is all good, um, then that's a wrap, you know, we're done. Our work here is done for this year. Um, we're going to take the car back to, back to home, to the SGS in Gloucestershire, 
and, uh, and start looking at the next side of the project. So, um, yeah, really great news, absolutely over the moon, absolutely fantastic. Uh, thanks for your support. It's been really great to have everybody with us on social media following us along. The whole team have loved that. It's been such good feeling from it all. So, uh, yeah, we're all really, really pleased. So, uh, and glad we could provide some entertainment. <laughs>